Howdy folks, Doc here with Last Best Tool. And this is one of those kind of like wheels on luggage moments. How, like, why did it take so long for us to figure this out? Um, this is a, a Top Don battery tester. This is a Top Don battery tester and charger. So what happens when you combine both the charger and the tester in one unit? It, you take it to a whole nother level and it gets even better. But first of all, I've got a battery here, pulled it out of a um, out of an RV. And when I run my tester here, do my battery test, regular flooded, cold cramping amp, cold cranking amps, uh, oh, power too low. You want to continue? I'm going to say, okay, it's going to go ahead and test the battery, even though it's, it's voltage is too low. Retest after charging. 42%, 11.85 volts. Okay, I ought to be able to just push a button and charge it now. Um, but I can't. Oh, but I can. So I'm going to connect this guy up. We'll take a look at what's going on. So here it is. Got that same 11.7 volts. Hmm. No buttons. What do I do? Well, what you do is you open the app. So by offloading the, the, all of the, basically the computer aspect onto an app, you can run it off your phone and take it literally to that next level. So uh, what are my testing options? Battery test. Um, Regular flooded, see cold, uh, got it all there. Voltage too low, please charge your battery first to have an accurate test result. Now, what you can do here is I can get the information about the battery prior to charging. Here it is, um, and I can save that. Um, if I had set it up for that right now and then if I go to um, well you, you can see I've also got a uh, charging test if I want to start the vehicle etc and do that um, and a cranking test got to get it all set up start cranking I can do that from the you know from my car basically um, but I'm going to set up the charging right now and I actually have two choices here I've got the smart charging and the quick charging um, if I go to smart charging basically it will take its time figure things out I can actually set up a time slot for it because if you live in a place where it matters you know at what time of day you're using electricity maybe the rates change or something so you can set it up for that um, or you have limited electricity or in sticks. You could have it do it in the middle of the night. Um, that's kind of interesting. Um, or I can do the quick charging. Um, I can set up the same time thing here, but basically I can start the charging right there. Now it's going to work. And it's giving me some information that matches my display here. Um, so here we go. Pretty exciting. It'll follow the the uh, current here, or the power. You can set it to the current or volt, current and voltage there, and watch this. And I can track this, and I can also um, compare it to the battery again when um, it, before it was charged. So I can actually do a couple of different ways of managing that that information. Anyway. Pretty cool stuff. Um, it's giving me the indication that it's charged. It's just going to keep on going whether I'm using the app right now or not. Um, but there's all kinds of uh, information. I can save my tests. Um, you know, set it up specifically for me. Up the the firm firmware upgrade and any software upgrades. Um, you know, are all baked into this, so I can uh, do a lot more than I can do with a, a conventional one. And it's a charger and a maintainer essentially, and um, a battery tester. 
So, I mean, gee, many, why didn't we do this a long time ago? These are on sale on Amazon. I actually got this one early. This is a beta model um, to do some testing with it. But this actually is available. Uh, I just checked for what that's worth, and it was $99. And then there was a uh, like a 20% off coupon or something like that. That's crazy. But anyway, Top Don makes top stuff. And um, I've used this a bunch now, and, and every time I'm just kind of impressed with it. I think in, in the future, there's probably going to be a whole lot more that you can do with something like this, um, especially, you know, when you connect it to a, to a smartphone um, and run, um, you know, more diagnostics, more, more stuff. But it's a Bluetooth connection, fires out to the phone, um, talks, talks to the phone, allows you to track, monitor everything. And then if you did the tests in a vehicle, um, you actually can get a, a um, graphical readout of exactly what's going on with the battery. So by combining these two, uh, I mean literally next level stuff here. And with that, Doc out.